Hey guys, Passive Baller here. We are now on this 7th uh, game or 7th prediction for this uh, day, December 29, 2021. Alright, this is uh, going to be the game between OKC Thunder with a record of 12-21 and, and the home team, Phoenix Suns, with a record of 26-7. and seven. This one will be played 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time, so that's 10 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. And before we proceed, I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account, our YouTube channel, Passive Baller, please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on the bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. Alright, let's take a look at the uh, Western Conference standings for these two teams. Phoenix Suns, they are at uh, number 2 in the West. Uh, for their last 10 games, they have won 7. Uh, unfortunately, approaching this game, they have actually lost back-to-back. -back. Very, very uncharacteristic for Phoenix Suns. Now for OKC, they are at number 14. Um, down there in the Western Conference. Approach, I mean, uh, for their last 10 games, they have won 5. So they're, you know, they have improved lately. But approaching this game, they are also coming off a loss. And that was last night against Sacramento Kings. Okay, all right. What do we have here? All right, here we go. Phoenix Suns, they'll be enjoying the home court advantage on this. Uh, at the same time, they would be having the uh, fatigue factor advantage as uh, OKC Thunder just played last night against uh, Sacramento Kings, so, uh, where they actually lost. Um, Momentum-wise, uh, we need to skip that one as uh, both teams are actually coming off losses. And let's take a look at uh, the injury list for both teams. OKC Thunder, we got Derek Favors, Josh Giddy, their rookie, Pokasevsky, uh, Jeremiah, Jeremiah Robinson Earl, sorry, Trey Mann, and Baisley. So that's two, four, six players out for OKC Thunder as of the moment. Um, while for Phoenix Suns, we got Aiton, uh, Crowder, Nader, Kaminsky and Sarich. Huh. All bigs, huh? Alright. Either forward or center here. So five players out for Phoenix Suns. So let's make this one quick. Um, this one's pretty academic. Phoenix Suns would actually win this game. So let's just talk about whether they would actually cover the spread or not. Well, let's take a look at the spread first. Well, it says here, as we speak, Phoenix Suns minus 15. All right, so as what I'm saying, this one's easy as to who's going to win. Phoenix Suns will take this one home. Uh, I like the effort of OKC lately, but you know they just can't do that against Phoenix Suns with you know with that kind of lineup with Earl Robinson out, with uh, Derek Favors out. You know, um, of course, uh, SGA would need some you know some some help. Actually, not some help, a lot of help. If they're going up against a team like this, Phoenix Suns. But the 15-point spread, um, I just don't know about that. Um, I will be picking OKC to cover the plus 15. Um, as I'm looking at Phoenix Suns, yes, to basically try to blow this one out early. But uh, towards the end of the game, I'm looking at the possibility that Phoenix Suns would actually rest their stars. And if I were the coach, I would do that as well. And uh, for OKC, they would actually play, you know, their bench players or those newly acquired 10-day 10 10 day players and all that. And for sure, they would be pushing even though the game has been, has been uh, decided already uh, sometime third or early fourth quarter. For sure, those kind of players would still push and would still play their guts out. And that's when the plus 15 would come in for me. So I'm picking OKC Thunder plus 15 on this. Thunder plus 15. Peace out. Pass love. God bless.